whisper.com My name is Jason Newland This is Deep Sleep Whisper Hypnosis I think it's number 73 I think So I've been doing these for a while I do try to aim to do one a day, but it doesn't always work out that way. Because I've been working on the websites and the podcast, and you know, it's quite a lot to do. It's quite a lot of work involved. Um, so I'd just like to take this opportunity to thank you for listening. Thank you for those that are listening for the first time and thank you for those of you that come back time and time again and have become regular listeners. This podcast is growing. Every week it's getting larger, not just in episodes but also in listeners and downloads. I think last week, in the last seven days, I think I've had about 2,000 downloads, if not more. Uh, so that's quite nice. The, um, so thank you for your support in that way, for listening. It's the best way you can support me, really. There are other ways you can support me. Maybe share these, this podcast with those that may also benefit. And if you choose, you want to help me to cover the costs of this free service, please go to paypal.me forward slash Jason Newland. Every little bit helps. And the link is on the podcast and on my website, jasonnewland.com. Right, that's a mouthful. So I can't I can't actually remember what I did last time. It's a couple of days ago. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do what I did myself last night as I was laying in bed. And it's something that I I don't do every night, but sometimes I do, so it's really about healing, because I have a great belief that our healing capacity is limitless. in listening to me uh, instead of medical attention I would never say that to always get medical help and professional help before using alternative therapies which this is kind of in that spectre I suppose alternative or self help always find out the cause of what's going on in your body or in your mind. So this, I know this is for sleep. I also know that not everybody listens to this just for the sleep part of it. Some will listen because uh, they may get the uh, benefits of ASMR from the whisper hearing the background sounds as well just you know maybe hearing me breathing which is always a good sign I do like to breathe and others may get the comfort of the familiarity of hearing same voice regularly a few times a week maybe 
seven days away. And of course, others just find that when you listen to me whispering, you find yourself getting back into that state of just relaxing completely. your body naturally just lets go of any tension or stresses that were there before you decided to listen to me and relax and your mind starts to slow down Those things that maybe were important to you before you decided to go to sleep you can still stay there. You can just let go of them. Just in the same way as the bed that you're sleeping is still going to be there when you wake up. You haven't got to keep opening your eyes to check that the bed's there. You haven't got to think about the bed. It's there. And that's it. It will still be there. In ten minutes' time. Will still be there in two hours time. Your bed will still be there when you wake up. Just as it is there when you lay down to go to sleep. So that kind of stuff doesn't require Whatsoever. In fact, it would be pointless thinking about it. Just as it's pointless thinking about anything else that will still be there when you wake up. Feel relaxed. Just 
and throughout the day it can be your jeans or your trousers or the skirt that you're wearing you can undo that and feel the release in your stomach the same way you can feel that release in your mind and just letting that drop to the floor allowing your mind to let go of those conversations that are no longer useful to you at this moment because you don't need that stuff when you're going to sleep just like if you were skiing down a mountain you wouldn't hold a microwave oven or a toaster there'd be no point you wouldn't need it and it would get in the way and it would slow you down and it would be no use now you can take your top off I find especially with my shoulders, my neck, my chest I like to take my top off because I feel much more free much more loose, more relaxed again that top can be the memories of times when you've maybe you know those thoughts in your mind about sleeping you know those limitations those worries take that top off and in your mind let that those worries and those thoughts just drop to the floor Just allowing yourself to connect that comfort between your body and your mind. Remembering that your brain and your body are connected 
organs can heal loving yourself loving every part of yourself every piece of skin on your body every freckle every mole loving each inch loving your hair regardless of what colour it is regardless of what length it is or how much you have face for the uniqueness knowing that you're the only person in the whole world that actually really looks like you unless you've got an identical twin there might be a few people out there that might look very similar that's among 